<coughs> well, hello everyone. I hope you're doing well. I uh, hope you're having a great week. Wow, it's been very hot down here in South Georgia. And uh, unfortunately, uh, I lost a musician, or we did, Mr. Tim Young from Fitzgerald, Georgia. Uh, great. Uh, musician played the piano, played uh, uh, the main instrument was the lead guitar, but he played the piano great. He also played a mandolin and he uh, played steel guitar some and played some of my lap steel guitars when he was up here. But anyway, he passed away last week. They having his funeral today, day on Sunday. So it's a sad day for the musician world. Tim played in a whole bunch of bands. I mean, he's been all over the country and went to Nashville, did recordings, played with Reba McIntyre one time, and uh, I mean, he's just a wonderful musician. But anyway, he's gone, but not forgotten. And one of my good friends that come over here, if you look way back on my early videos, you'll see him, usually he's sitting down in the, playing a Telecaster, sitting down in the uh, chair while I'm behind him with the steel guitar. And, uh, all right, what we gonna do today, we gonna explore a little bit about your uh, scales. I hope everybody can see this clearly. Uh, if you're on a big computer screen, I know you can, but well, we're gonna do a G chord. And I'm in the tuning of open E. In case you're wondering, I always teach in open E. Sometimes I do C6 and D, but my preferred tuning playing anywhere is open E. And it's just because I'm a guitar player and I can, uh, recognize the guitar notes from the old me and you can kind of transpose them over to your guitar when you're playing in an f position you know how you make an f on the guitar well you up there at the first string. and then you got a, a g flat and then a g and the g would be the same place you would put your finger right here behind it so, we you lay your bar right on top. Now, talking about scales, we can play, I use scales a lot and you'll see me. Ah, basically what that is. So it Thank you. 
But anyway, when I ain't seen me moving, a lot of times I'm just kind of following the scale. <laughs> I'm not doing them one note at a time, I'm just using the whole bar over the top of it. So you can just add different notes with it. It's a call, it's a pole. But you gotta pause in the right spot. So you would start off at a G on the third fret. Pause right there at the fifth fret, seventh fret, and then strum it again at the eighth fret. Instead of pausing, I just, you can do that. touching the, the little E string on the fifth fret and the back bar is resting on the fourth fret. So.
kind of music you can get out of these laugh steals, isn't it? <laughs> No one. I like to mix it up, get you some sound. for the D. record it and then maybe I put some words on it and that, that right there is one I've already I've already recorded sounds great with lead guitar over the top of it and some keyboard and a bass and uh, it's kind of a Pink Floyd sound in this song
try something new, don't be scared to learn something, you know, 99% of the time, and I mean 99% of the time when I'm on YouTube, I'm trying to learn something. Uh, if you want to know something, just go on YouTube and type it in, and uh, get, don't just go by one opinion, though, get two or three opinions on it, like I did, uh, you know, and so, anyway, y'all be sure to keep Tim uh, Young and family in your prayers today. His funeral is today, and we're going to dearly miss him. Uh, so, I hope everybody's having a great week out there and uh, getting ready for 4th of July. If y'all are getting ready for 4th of July, uh, one thing I'm going to ask you to do is be considerate of the animals. Uh, if you got dogs and cats or whatever that I would run on, bring them on in the house for that night. Let them out in the morning, they won't kill you, uh, you know. But let them in and pet them while the popping's going on. great week out there and hope to see you soon and if you're not subscribed please subscribe give me a thumbs up it helps our channel uh we got our facebook group going we got lots of people over there now over six thousand thank you for that uh, a lot of people are putting in some good music uh and also by golly we're gonna be talking about songwriting later on i didn't really uh want to go into it this morning much except songwriting starts off with good music <laughs> Still the greatest, but the right songs on. I mean, you got so many ways you can voice things. this right here. If we don't do something sooner, we uh, need rain down here in South Georgia Bay. We got a 59% yesterday chance of rain. Didn't get a drop. I don't know where it went. We got a 59% again today. Don't know if it's going to rain. We ain't got a cloudy sky right now here in South Georgia, but they do got some kind of tropical depression coming in around Savannah. I thought maybe that'll push some water this way. Uh, right now, it is really dry. I'm having to water my garden nearly uh, twice a week now. And, and, and it is going to be a heat index of over 100 today. So, wow. Yeah, it's that hot down here. Y'all have a great week.